wears the same color as Thomas and the same size as James. He can pull coaches and push freight cars, and he often works as a back engine, but Edward is all not as strong as the other engines. Sometimes Edward feels left out. The Duke and Duchess of Boxford came to visit their new summer house. They came on their own private engine called Spencer. Spencer is big and silver and very fast. When Spencer pulled into Knapford, his driver had exciting news for him. You have beaten Gordon's record, he said. Of course, boasted Spencer. I am faster and finer than all the engines on soda put together. Sir Topham Hath's engines were very cross. Spencer is just a big silver show off. It's gorgeous, and everyone agreed. Sir Topham Hath spoke to the engines. Spencer will take the Duke and Duchess to their summer house. Other engines will take the ferry. Sir Topham Hath's engines saw the chance for a race. Please, sir, said Tom. Percy, Gordon, and James all together. Hey, I go. You all have other work to do. Boom, Sir Topham Hath. Edward will take the furniture. James and Gordon groaned. Fancy sending a back engine to do an express engine's job. Stiff Gordon. He'll lose the race and let the whole railway down. Said Jane. Thomas and Percy were cross. Edward was their friend. Spencer has a bigger boiler, said Thomas. But that just means more hot air. An honest steamy can beat a pouty puffer any day, added Percy. Edward set off slow and steady. We'll do my best. We'll do my best. He puffed. Spencer set off and quickly passed Edward. I've won already, he boasted, and with a whoosh, he was gone.